Hello and welcome back to the series. So in the last video, we just finished with the footer and the header JS components of our app. In this video, we are going to make the movies and the movies components. So inside the source, I'm going to make a new folder known as containers to store our containers. So inside the containers, I'm going to add a new file named movies.js to store all our movies. Okay. Now RCC is for class based, the snippet shortcut RCC is for class based and RFC is for functional base which do not require class. Okay, so RCC tab inside the app.js, this is an RFC and this is an RCC with this extends a class from the component. Okay, so inside the div, I don't need this guy over here, so let me delete this guy inside the div we have so first of all let me initialize it with a state so inside the class based component we have a state now state is initially empty but i will fill it with the movies array and inside the movies array i have a list of uh, json objects with name and key value pairs so we have the first name as john wick so let us suppose this is our first movie we are going to add it is John Wick Parabellum the latest one and we have the genre as action and the year as genre is action and the year is let us suppose it came in 2019 yes it came in 2019 now I'm going to duplicate it over here so we can have a bunch of movies initially uh, one two three four five six we have a uh, seven movies over here seven or six movies over here so this is our movies array with seven movies inside it so now we will render all of these seven movies inside our div and we are going to do this with the map function so we have a div with the class name of movies okay inside that div we I am going to render all of these movies one by one. So I'm going to use this dot state and referring to this thing over here, the state, and then dot movies. Dot movies. Now this movie will refer to the movie array I'm using over here. So it will point to this array over here, dot movies. Since this is an array, I can use the map function over here, and then the map function takes an argument, the movie and then we have i want to return the map function wants a return statement i want to return a single movie with the name genre and action so as for now i will render the movie component the movie component is not made yet i will make it in a moment but we will render the movie component with the key property because i'm using with the list because i'm working with the list i need a key property for sure so to avoid duplicacy so i have key is movie dot name okay but unfortunately the movie name is also same so let me add a new property as id so that it can be identified so we have id as one so for one we have one two three and then four and then five and so on six and seven now i have given all the different ids to all the movies so now i can have movie dot id as the key which is identical okay we're going to use name we're going to name movie dot name we're going to pass it as a prop name and then genre as movie dot genre and then year as movie dot year okay now i'm going to close this movie component over here but now it comes complains that the movie component it shows a red line under the movie component because it is not made yet so i'm going to make this movie component so first of all inside the components or inside the components i'm going to make a new file i'm going to name it exactly as movie.js so inside this movie this is a functional component now it will render all the movies individually so this is an individual movie what an individual movie will contain 
now we have a div inside the div i don't want another div sorry inside the div we have a class name of card i want the movie to be shown as a card so i have a card inside that i have a div with uh, class name as what can be the class name but the class name can be a container that is suppose it is container and then inside the container div i have a h2 heading 2 with props dot name the name of the movie so we have the prop named as name inside the movies coming from the movies so we have props dot name but before using the props from here the movies i'm going to pass it to this movie component over here by using the props inside the function so now i can access props dot name this will refer to this prop name over here in the movies so we have h2 with props dot name and then generally an h4 or a paragraph or which ones is better h4 we will we can use props dot genre for the genre and then a space dash and then props dot ear so as to make them separate so now we have the prop dot name genre and ear all from the movies array over here and now we are going to import the movie component import movie from the components and inside components i have movies.js components component slash movie.js okay so now it's the complaint is gone so now we have added a single movie over here and we are going to extract we're going to render all of these seven movies to the front end so let us name this component not name as movies so let me rename it first as capital m movies so that the name does not clashes so now we are going to import this movie component inside the app.js so that it can be rendered to the front end so we have import movies with capital m of course from components from containers sorry from containers and then movies the component which contain all the movies okay so inside header and footer the tag I'm going to enter movies so my if I check my console okay so now here we are all the movies are showing with John Wick Parabellum as a name and then the action as genre and 2019 as the year so now this is a default setup now this is showing all the movies seven movies or eight movies over here to the front end so now so now we are done with renting all the movies and individual movies from the components to our uh, react front end so now in the next video we are going to see how to manipulate this movies component and make the final version of these movies components so that we can finish our front end and then switch to our back end. So I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.